Hello everyone! RPG Kingdom Kid here with a new Let's Play of Shin Megami Tensei 3 Nocturne and a... I know I was, I was gonna hit a button. I was like... I was gonna hit the button. There we are. <laughs> but yes, guys. This is Shin Megami Tensei Noc 3 Nocturne. Probably one of... One of Atlas's major games ever i i honestly can't remember if this came out before persona 3 i'm gonna say it did but at the same time i'm not entirely sure um i believe this was the first shin Megami tensei of the shin Megami tensei lines that came out in uh, outside of Japan, I believe, because I don't think we got Shin Megami Tensei 1 and 2. I could be completely wrong on that, so, uh, don't quote me on that, but, uh, yeah, um, and obviously I have played the original. I don't, I honestly can't remember if I beat it or not, if I'm being entirely honest with you. Uh, with Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne, it's kind of the same thing with Persona 3 with me. Uh, my cousin had a friend that he borrowed the game from. And I was able to play it. But I, again, don't remember if I beat it or not. Mm, so, but yeah, this game is amazing. And with this HD um, coming up, I'm actually going to have the volume all the way to the max for the, the voice. And maybe... Oh, I accidentally moved it all the way down to nothing. Um, and maybe I'll put the sound effects up and everything else up by two besides these. So, confirm. So, make sure that that all saved. It's hard to tell. Okay. But, yes, guys. Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne 3. Well, Shin Megami Tensei 3 Nocturne. Uh, with the possibility of Shin Megami Tensei 5 coming out this year, I, I again, I don't know if that's actually going to happen. Um, I'm excited for this. I'm excited for this game. So, uh, let's start a new game. Uh, a level difficulty suitable for those seeking the thrill of death. The standard level for difficulty. I'm gonna just pick hard. Or normal, I mean. Um, I hope I get... A world that loses its power will fade into nothing. Give me one second here. I'm going to make sure that I will have bonus stuff. Give me one second here. Okay, I think I should be fine, hopefully. I don't know. If such is the fate of this world, Okay. Then I shall return it to its mother's womb. The world must first die for it to be born again. This is the path to salvation, as foretold in an ancient prophecy. Okay. The world will fall for its sins, and everyone living will vanish. But I won't let you meet the same fate. I want to help you hold on to your life. To do so, I need to know your name. Will you tell My me who you are? My name is... My name is Dante from the Devil May Cry series. Oh lordy. Oh god. The thing is, I don't think he has an actual... I don't think the character here has an actual name. You know, I'm gonna just quickly look at that up just to be sure. And he does. He does have a uh, full name. 
So the family name is... He actually didn't get one until a, a drama CD was released. Enter a nickname, uh... Now. <clears throat> That's right. As of now, your will to live shall sustain you. Believe in it. And survive. Okay. I, I honestly can't understand. remember if they had voice acting in the original Nocturne or not. The time is near. Everything that is will be rewritten. I am the nurturer of the next world. The template for our future rests within my hands. Now, I want you to say my name aloud. Yep. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep that. That's right. Yuko Takao. <sighs> no. I won't shed another tear. Not even at this world's end. Instead, I can invite you to the world that is to come. Okay. Now go ahead. Wake up. The time is here. Like I said, I've never... I can't remember if I beat SMT3 or not, but I have been SMT4 and uh, Shin Megami Tensei 4 Apocalypse. Yo, Yogi Cohen. Yo, so. Yogi Cohen. Please do not rush onto the train. The door it's is Ray open. Chase! As the train announcer. Hmm. Receive a message. You're late, Naoki. What's the big idea? Forgot we're visiting Miss Takao today. Just get to Yo Yo Guy Park ASAP. Time's a wasting. It's from your classmate. Please enter your classmate's name. Okay, I'm gonna assume there wasn't any voice acting. You know, talk, I prefer more of a private counseling scenario, but Miss Takao is a lot nicer when you're around. All right, be sure to dress to impress. After all, you represent me by way of association. How about that slick jacket you brought the other day? The one with the little demon sprites? Remember, you're just the mood maker. Don't get it twisted, okay? Whatever. So, do I have a map or anything? It does not seem like that way. Hey, train dude. Let me guess, you're here for Yogo Park? Ever since that incident went down, it's been one lucky loo after another. No one's here for the train. As you can probably tell, I've got a lot of time on my hands. Dude, I literally just came back. I just came off of a train. Shut up. You've heard the news, right? No. Guess I'd inform you. There was a deadly ride at Yo-Yo Yo Guy Park yesterday. If you want that gory details, go check the giant screen at Shibuya. Long story short, a couple of folks lost their lives in that park. You can hear the sirens wailing all night long. Anyway, sorry to talk your ear off. Probably not something they should be doing at the job, eh? Well, I wanted to know where to go, but you were no help. Hmm. Should I climb up the stairway to fog, or... Go to the fog of war, or... Okay, I guess that's the only way to go. This actually plays really well. 
Like, it feels nice playing this game. Will you leave the area? No. No, fam, I'm good. Due to the investigation, the entrance to the Yoko Park has been closed off. We appreciate your concern. Cooperation. There's a live report going on. While I do feel the demonstrators' actions were out of line, the fact that cyber communications would destroy the park for their own gain is not only inconceivable, it's unforgivable. The poor's impression speech passionate speech continues. Yeesh, kids these days. One moment we're suffering fatalities, the next everyone's dressed like it's a goddamn carnival. Take that long-haired yippie wandering around, for instance. Can overhear a couple's conversation. Did you hear about the riot where the three people died? What if we're next? You don't go worry about that, babe. Why? Because we're about to start our own little ride in the bedroom. Wow, could you be any more predictable? <laughs> but I guess that's what I love about you. Okay, have fun, you two. You overhear a conversation between my school girls. So don't tell me, I already know. You think Hikawa is super hot, right? Um, you, there's like so many nasty rumors about him. I know, to me, the only ads in it. That only adds to it. He's got intrigue. A whole world of lore built around him. Oh, I thought there was like something down here. Damn it. So I have someone over there, and someone right here, and someone over there. Oh, hey, Naoki. You said you were going to visit Miss Taco today, right? I know she's beautiful, but that doesn't give you license to creep on her, okay? Uh, I mean, I was just going to visit her. Been chased by this wild dream. How did you might say? In my dreams, everywhere you look, everything is round. The world itself is round. Oh dang, Nabbit! I know the world is round, but it got round in a different way. I'm telling you, my dream is a pro prophecy, and yet no one believes me. You know, keep part right. No, oh, you mean what they're showing on TV? I don't know. It's just it hardly seems real. Like, how could this be happening here? But it doesn't involve me. News is drawing on the giant video display. Yoink. All right, broke out yesterday at Yoko Park regarding the construction of a commu communication tower. Demonstration got out of hand and there have been several deaths and injuries reported. Furthermore, Hikawa, the top executive of Cyber's Communications, remains missing. Stay tuned to see what the weather forecast has planned. News continues. News is showing the giant video display. Oh, shit. Is it going to like show the exact same thing? Yes, it is. Well, now what? Ah, hello. Didn't talk to you people. Yo, Naoki, what's up? Did you hear the rumor about Yoko Park? Yes. Well, it's just a rumor. No. I heard on the night of the ride, a demon spawned somewhere in the park. And that demon was the one behind the killings. Well, it's just a rumor. Okay, that part I didn't hear. Being here is starting to depress me. That riot's got everyone else shaken up. You look like a decent enough guy. Let's forget all this doom and gloom and have ourselves some fun. Okay. Sure. Oh, not again. Our hospital up ahead hasn't been open for a while. What's going on? This student in a real sharp uniform passed by not long ago. The way he carried himself was really dignified like. Oh, and he had a cat with him. Black as the uniform he wore. I don't know why, but something about that vintage style. Maybe the hat and the cape. I know I've seen it somewhere. Alright, uh, I guess I gotta get to the park.
The entrance is closed, but we're not guarding this back entrance, so uh, fuck you. Great. The entire park's closed off. They can't even let a guy in to snap a few photos? <sighs> Guess it's not my lucky day. Huh? Hey! You need something, kid? Not in particular. Fair enough. This kind of thing's not your bag, I say more power to you. Besides, if I had told you this was a battle between two cults, you'd probably call me nuts. I probably should have picked the first option, but oh well. So if it starts to rain. Uh, I think that's your phone going off. Hey, are you there? Finally I get a hold of you. What's taking you so long? Please enter your classmate's name. Hey, Chiaki. Tachibana. I could see if it was our other friend, but you're never late. You wake up on the wrong side of the bed? Where are you now? Yoyogi Park? Well, since you decided not to show, we had to leave without you. We're almost there now. So, yeah, would you mind coming straight to the hospital? You do know which hospital it is, right? Shinjuku Medical Center. Just go east from Shinjuku Station and keep going. You can't miss it. Hmm, I guess this works out. I was planning to ask our teacher for career advice, so I'll just go ahead of you. I'll be there as soon as possible. I don't plan on staying too long. Okay, see you later. Jackie, hold up. Hold up. You're on your way to Shinjuku Medical Center? Hmm. That's also where I'm headed, oddly enough. Go figure. Why don't you hang on to this? It's a copy of our upcoming issue. I'm assuming you don't know what went down here. Then, you probably don't know what kind of place that hospital is either. The name's Why? Sichiri, it's a hospital. Author of the Ring of Gaia and the Scripture of Moroku. Might want to give that a read. Okay. Cause I'll just read anything any strange man gives me. Normally, you wouldn't associate a hospital with the occult. But that hospital is anything but normal. Or so they say. There's a lot of misinformation floating around these days. If it turns out I'm wrong, just laugh it off, okay? Um, okay. Anyway, I'd better be going. Oh yeah. In the event we run into each other again, let me know how you liked my article. I'll be sure to give it a read. Well, I have no way of opening it up, so... Alright, let's just go east. Alright, that's not it. Was that the hospital right there? It is. There's a note on the door. The entrance to the annex is closed. Please use the entrance to the main building, hospital staff. Alrighty. Oh, auto map? Oh. Sup. Well, hey, about time. Um, is it just me? 
Or is something seriously off here? Hmm... There isn't anyone in sight. No nurses? No patients? Look, even the reception desk is empty. Don't you think there's something weird about this place? I sure do. Nah, anyway, you're overthinking it. You know who is looking for our teacher right now. And big surprise, he's still gone. He'd better not be off goofing around. Oh, what's with that magazine? Some guy gave it to me. Some stranger gave it to you? He said he's the writer. Come on, you should know better than that. It's not like I had a choice. Ayakashi Monthly. I've never heard of it before. What? It's an occult magazine? Why would you bring something like that here? I don't know. <sighs> well, maybe it could help me kill some time. Anyway, can you go find that bonehead? If he can't find our teacher, then I don't want to be here another minute. Shouldn't we should know what room our teacher's floor, in? Where the patient's rooms are? Well, if the patient's room is only on the second floor, then why is it such a hard time to find her? Listen, I'm just asking the questions here, okay? Like, I'm just asking questions. I'm just like, oh. I'll be waiting down here. Oh, and leave the mag with me. And leave the mag with me. They just not voice that? Don't leave me hanging too long, okay? They just not voice that second bit? How's the magazine? Can you go find our friend? I see no point in staying if our teacher's not here. He's probably somewhere on the second floor. This magazine is so bizarre. Okay. Select a floor. Let's go to the basement floor. Huh. Oh, roof. Hospitals only have two floors and a basement floor and a roof. That seems like a small hospital. Someone's in the other hallway. See a vending machine. You have enough change to buy a drink. Will you buy something? Sure. Seems the drink isn't listed on the machine. You obtain a mysterious drink. Okay. Ha have I learned how to open up a menu yet? <laughs> how much money do I even have? Can I buy another drink? Van machine is sold out. Okay. Yo, asshole. scared the crap out of me. Why'd you go sneaking up like that? Jeez, you come here late, you cause trouble. You know what? Forget it. Not worth it. I'm sure you've already noticed, but this place has been cleaned out. You think everyone, uh, died off? I called our teacher to make sure this was it. She clearly told me. Shinjuku Medical Center. Ah, uh, who voices you? Something's up. 
I could have at least put up a notice or something so visitors aren't clueless. Maybe someone unleashed a deadly virus in here. Yo, hey, in this climate. I've already checked out everywhere she might be. I'm running out of places to look. Think we should just call it? All right, I'm gonna head back down and check out how our other lady's doing. I bet she's all pissed because I've been gone so long. <sighs> it ain't easy pleasing a princess. Anyway, Don't get me wrong. I really hope this isn't the shitstorm it's shaping up to be. Don't get me wrong. I don't mind the fact that they're like, like they kept it true to the game where you name all the characters except like, you know, the other characters. Um, like you name your two friends and the teacher. Don't get me wrong. I don't mind that, that they kept that. But at the same, and I think that's that like it helped back then when there was no voice acting because I highly doubt there was any voice acting in OG Nocturne. But they could have at least just you know have kept it. Let's go check out the room, see if there's anything. And, um, I don't think there's anything in them, but still. Plus, it's not like it takes too long to go from room to room here. Please stop. <laughs> Insert your annex gate pass. Oh, I don't have one. The door will not open. Well, gee, I wonder why. What is the point of this hallway? The door will not open. But there's something on the door. Special report at the beginning of the magazine? Uh -huh. Well, it says some things that are more than a little unsettling. According to this, there's a group of demon worshippers who call themselves the Ring of Gaia. And they're right here in Japan. Mm. Apparently, they believe in this book of prophecy called the Scripture of Miroku. In that book, it says that chaos will engulf the world and these people are trying to cause that somehow. Whether their idea of chaos means terrorism or something else entirely, the reporter couldn't figure that out. But get this. Uh, no luck finding her. I even checked the men's room. Ugh, didn't need to know that. We're in the middle of a conversation here, so save those details for later. Now, listen to this part. A hospital on the east side of Shinjuku is closely linked to the organization's sinister plan. Let me guess, 
That ends with... Find out more in our next issue. Though it wouldn't surprise me if that article had some truth to it. I've heard some real spooky shit about this place. Like how they run deadly experiments on patients. Or how a psychic started shrieking and bolted out of here. And of course, there's a rumor that a cult's behind it all. You're serious? I never knew any of that. Maybe we really shouldn't have come here. I almost feel stupid for buying into some bizarre tabloid. But it does get one thing right. How creepy this hospital is. Mm-hmm. We really need to find her, don't we? Okay. We search this place top to bottom one last time. If nothing pops up, we assume nothing's wrong, and we split. By the way, looks like you can reach the annex from the second floor. I'll go take a look up there. Whereas you have the honor of searching the basement. Oh, and uh, you'll need this. You're the one who found the card. Why don't you search the basement? Could it be you're too scared? Come on, this is me we're talking about. The only reason he's going is because I'm sure there's nothing down there. Look, all you need to do is confirm that our teacher isn't in the basement. Got it? After all, saving the day is my job. Should things take a turn for the worse, just run like hell, okay? I can't believe him sometimes. Anyway, let's focus on finding our teacher. No matter what, we have to make sure she's safe. Yeah, we 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 should do that. Guess we should go check the basement. Oh boy. Sounds like fun. <sighs> I love how it's now called Underground Facility. It's like, what? Isn't it just the basement? Insert your ID card. How'd you get an ID card? Well, that looks nice. Nope, nothing cultish happening in that room. Well, that's like a normal hospital room. 
hear eerie sounds coming from this room. Will you enter? Nah. I want to keep exploring. Hmm. Oh, this is where they store the dead bodies. It's not called the morgue, but what's it called? Um. Or is it is it called the morgue? Is that where they put like the dead bodies in like hospital slash um police stations? Not police stations, but you know what I mean, like where they examine the dead bodies. That's not the morgue, is it? I don't think so. I thought that had a different name. Oh, hello. Who is it? Who dares disrupt this stillness? Only a lost lamb. A well-known poet once said, April is the cruelest month. Have you any inclination as to why? Because it is then one awakens from a long sleep and faces the barren world. Our history as a species is similarly barren, comprised of empty trivialities. Mm. The worthless overgrowth of a civilization blind to its sins. Continuous war and bloodshed. In thousands of years of repeating the same mistakes over and over again, the world needs to wipe its slate clean. Sounds fun. The way to salvation was foretold in the scripture of Miroku. And today, that prophecy shall be fulfilled. The old world will sink like a setting sun and the new world will arise in its place now how should i deal with you from what i recall you weren't among our followers who survived the purge at the park i wasn't at the park i'm looking for a teacher oh you're her acquaintance Oh, you Come know her. to think of it, this was a hospital, wasn't it? And you merely came to visit her. Yeah, and you're the one that spouted out some gibberish, so that's on you, dude. However, even a pebble creates ripples when cast in water. I don't know who voices you, but you sound like someone who voiced the JoJo character. And while I do feel pity for you... I mean, you're the one who told me your plan, so blame yourself, your dude. ends here. Dude, that was all your fault, by the way. Um, Do huh. not be afraid. All the inhabitants of this world will follow before long. Your time has just come a bit sooner. That's all. Dude, it's... You fool. No one can overcome their fate. Yeah, I feel like no matter which one I picked, it would have been the same. Stop! Huh? Sup? What? You can't even let one person go? What effect could he possibly have on our plan? However insignificant he is, I am not a man of exceptions. You know this. Fine. If you don't spare him, then consider our partnership over. <sighs> Such a troublesome maiden. Well, I'll leave the teaching to the teacher. Please leave this room. I would like to enjoy this blissful end in solitude. I'll be waiting on the roof. We'll have a good view of the city from there. Come, um, okay. See it with your own eyes. Witness see that what? which will change the world. 
<laughs> I don't like this. That was fun. Let's go talk to that dude again. <laughs> Door cannot be open. Well, gee, you should have done that the first time, asshole. And this one's locked on the other side, so. I still can't open up a goddamn menu. Weird that that still has an exclamation point on it. Oh, hello. Someone is up ahead. What's wrong, my little master? Are you curious about that person over there? Oh, is that so? My, my. But right now, we have other matters to attend to. Let's do that afterwards. Okay. Well, okay. Child and the old woman have disappeared. Well, that's just normal, you know? That's just normal in a hospital. Children and old people just disappearing. It's normal. Let's go talk to my friend, be like, hey, we found the teacher. We found this cult dude. He almost killed me. My friend's not going to be there, is she? Jackie isn't in the lobby. Well, shit. Let's find my other friend. He should be at the annex, so that door should be open. Right. I believe, yeah, it was this one that went to the annex. Well, I guess the door doesn't stay open like the one in the basement does. Fine, I guess we'll go to the roof and go talk to teacher lady tits. Even though you can't really see them in this. Ah. So, here we are again. I'm glad I intervened when I did. I wouldn't want you to fall prey to a demon. You heard what Hikawa said, right? Yeah! You know, he said his plan in front of someone that honestly had no idea what the fuck this was going on, so... swallowed by chaos. It's called the Conception. Ah, the Conception. The rebirth of the world. An event which no human has ever witnessed. Everyone outside of this hospital will perish. I doubt anyone would approve of such a terrible thing. Yeah. Mass world genocide might be frowned upon. Even if we did keep this old world alive, it would eventually lose all its power. The world must first die for it to be born again. And I alone will carry the burden of its sin. Oh, uh, you're gonna carry on the burden of sin, huh? I just wanna make sure my mic is working. Yes. Yes, let's make sure my mic is working after recording for over 40 minutes As here. As for regrets, I have none. What matters is that fate reached out and led you here. Uh, uh are you calling yourself fate because you're the one and that said to call us here? it is your fate to live through the conception. I mean... Again... Okay, if it's my fate, then you're the it one that told me whatever. It may actually be more painful than death. Oh, okay. But I believe in you. Please. Come find me when it's done. No matter how the world changes, I'll be your pillar of strength. It is my duty as the Maiden to take part in shaping the new world. Meaning I can show you a better way to live. Will you now? I know it must be difficult for you to understand, but we're out of time. Listen, if you can find me on your own, I promise to tell you everything. 
the answers yeah, to all yeah. your questions and what my intentions really are. Oh, okay. It's not the end of the world, but you can see it from here. Oh, wait, it is the end of the world. I thought it started with an earthquake. Birds and snakes and airplanes. But is Lenny Bruce not afraid? Huh. Hmm. To be honest, I probably could have done better with these cutscenes. But, ah well. I won't fault them too much on it. They're still decently okay, but again, it could have been a lot better. They're going ham on that organ. Oh, it's becoming a sphere like that one dude was talking about. He's probably dead now because he's not at the hospital. What is that? You who would enter my world, reveal your heart to me. I mean, I'd rather not. My heart's in my chest. You have nothing stirring within you, not even a hint of reason. Oh, okay. For the one who will shape the world, this cannot be. Go forth and discover yourself. Okay. What will be the legacy of your existence? I don't know, Papa Nier. Or Sojuro. Eh, it's blinding. Oh, wow. Do not be afraid. My little master has taken an interest in you. Oh, okay. So I won't be afraid. Pitiful human though you are, he wishes to grant you a gift. I'm a pitiful human now, huh? It is vital that you receive it, and I'm afraid you have no choice. Well, if I have no choice... Please try not to struggle. Uh, what? what? It will only hurt for an instant. I'd rather it not hurt. What is that? Enjoy your last moments as a human. Oh, okay. 